Hey, it's your boy back in again with another video. So, we're gonna continue by playing Devil May Cry 5. Okay, let's see what we gotta do. Hmm. Okay, so. That's a dope looking design for his um, biomechanical arm, though. Ooh. I need to be careful because, man, that hurt. Oh, that's hot. Oh, that's hot. But yeah, they wouldn't play this game, man. These bats, I'm guessing they're called like pyro bats. I'm pretty sure. I think I found it before. I don't know, though. But, alright. Let's see what we gotta do. Yeah, um, this is the third mission now. And yeah, I was gonna say, for those who have never played a Devil May Cry game, make sure you know, look around at every single snoop and cranny of the game no, because they're always hybrid orbs, lords, and everything you actually so need to uh, upgrade your skill level and stuff. Which is why you gotta be careful and look around at every corner in the game. Like, for instance, see, I'm about to go behind this uh, conditioning unit and see what's up with that. Yep, that's dope. Got a new arm. Oh, that's hot. Yep. Yeah, it's there, goes, there goes another one. Mm -hmm. Yep, I see this one right there. I can't jump towards it because obviously I gotta use the grappling mechanic that they have, which is kind of like zip lining for this game. The equivalent of Sekiro with the zip lining effect. Different things I can't do it anywhere. I have to do it more specifically geared towards a certain area. So that'll be fun. Um, yeah, I was gonna say I wish I could, but I'm trying to figure that one out too. How to get over there? Like, if I could just get over there and then get that and then come back over here, that'd be cool. But I'm probably not gonna do that because I don't wanna waste too much time. Uh, I think it'd be too difficult to do right now, if I'm being 100% honest. Oh, so I got more demons here. Yeah, let me go grab that real quick beforehand. I mean, like, I know I'm about to fight all these demons and stuff, but, like, eh. Okay. Yeah, that's right. That's right, get over here. Mm hmm. You finna catch this up, young fella. Yep, that's right, get C. Go. I wanna at least get the BA on this, man. I'm trying to get triple S's because I heard you can get triple S's in this game and I've never, you know, I've done that yet. Because I've gotten to let alone the S with the A. Hey. Sorry, I'm kind of tired, but yeah, this is, man, I love the uh, amount of detail they have in this game. Not only that, like just... Oh, wait, wait, was that an S? Oh, that was the S, too. We got an S for a slight moment. So I ain't really tripping. We at least got a, got a decent, almost full S. So, not that bad. All right, we're going to see. Oh, they got loot. That's dope. Yeah, like, you got to be careful with this game. Cause they'll be hiding in the most obscene places because you wouldn't think they'd be there. Like, for instance, the crevice of the building, like, uh, it's probably not there. And you find out they got all this stuff and the gold orb, and you just like look back on it, you're like, I really should have went back there and did that. <laughs> Man. But yeah, look, this game is dope. I really enjoy it, though, to be honest with you guys. And I really enjoy making the uh, gameplay for you guys, because, you know. Letting me, allowing me to express myself to gaming. I know I'm not the best gamer, obviously, but I mean, for me, that's not what matters more of. Unless, like, it's a competitive game more of, I'll do my best to get better. I mean, that's for everything. But specifically, like, I just want to have fun with this game because that's really what I feel like this is all about. Just having fun and progressively getting better. That's kind of what I want to have uh, reflected this channel be of to a certain extent. No, not gonna jump back into all that. Yeah, I was really hoping that was towards a better over over there, but I guess not. So we're just gonna go back to where we are gonna go, anyways. 
But yeah, so far I think Nair is my favorite character as of currently, like right now. Just cause it's getting, this guy got a biomedical, mechanical arm, my bad. Can't talk to him for some reason. But I think that's pretty dope. And then think about it, right? So like, don't get me wrong. It would be cool to have a demon arm. This but down. having a biomechanic arm wouldn't be as bad, let's be real here. Especially with the abilities this has now. Cause like, you know, remember the first mission basically, you know, every time the arm gets damaged, it can just reproduce itself and become better, I believe so. That's what it seems like at least from what we saw from the first mission. So there's that. I'm gonna try to jump out there and see what's up with that. Mm. Eh, I'll just go over here. Why not? I'm gonna slice the next these guys right here. With some free red orbs and blue and so on and so forth. This XP as well too. Cause they give it a lot of that for some reason, so that's cool. Yeah, no, you're gonna say Desmo. Eh, could be worse. It's not like there was enough enemies anyways. There were just a whole bunch of floating arms. Well, spikes, if anything. Hmm. Yeah, like just the just the sheer amount of detail in this game. Like, look, you see that bridge? That bridge looks dope. It's everything. Like, it's just this game just looks sick to me. Hundred percent honesty. Y'all accept whatever y'all want. I think this game looks dope. Now, Days Gone though, that's a really crisp looking game. It seems like they spent their time on it. Like, actually spent their time on it. Alright, we're gonna go this way. Alright, yep. We get those red orbs real quick. We get this gold orb too. Yeah, I don't really wanna keep try to use too many red orbs because it's like they're very useful and whatnot, so I mean red orbs are useful too, but it's like there's more of those than let's say gold orbs and what I've noticed at least so far. That might just be me though. I'm just about to check if they got any more red or blue or anything. Real quick. Yeah, we're just gonna. Okay, we're just gonna go in there now. Just to be sure. Could never be too careful because this game be hiding so much stuff to the point where it's not even funny. Like, for instance, you'll be fighting a boss or whatever, and then you're like, oh wait. The previous mission, I kind of just got all this extra cool stuff, and turns out, you know, I decided not to look for it. And then you feel stupid. So, well, at least they disintegrate to unlock new areas, so that's cool. We'll grab this new arm. And let me break these red orbs. Because I'm probably going to need all the stuff I'm going to get. 100% honestly. Right, let's go just. Oh, snap. We got to fight these guys too. Yup, that's these hands. You know what time it is. Yo, let's keep going. Yo. Gotta be sure. Cause man, they be everywhere. Oh. See, I told you, see? If I wouldn't have decided to look that way, I probably wouldn't have found it. If we're being realistic here. Hmm. Hmm. Alright. I believe I was fighting a whole bunch of demons, but I think I kind of lagged a little bit. Oh, no, wait, yeah, no. So I'm going to go back, fight those demons, and do what I got to do for that part. It just did a lag for some reason. It was really slow. I'm sorry about that. The fact that you can't hear it, it just overlaid for some reason, oddly enough. You know, hopefully I'll figure out what's up with that next time. And uh, I'll search that up on what goes on with that. More in depth. Okay.
Alright, so we basically just beat all those demons, I believe. So, yup. And what we're gonna do now... Go over here, figure out what's up with this. Yeah, because basically what happened was I killed all these demons. It was being weird, like I said. I'm gonna have to figure out what's up with that next time. But, we'll get started this right over. We'll get some extra XP, open a new area to uh, discover and look through. So that's gonna be fun. And there's some demons over here, too. We just ended up killing two. Uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure. Oh, no, wait. Oh, they're... No, yeah, they're gonna show up. Sorry, I thought there weren't any demons here, too, actually. Now that I think about it. But, like, they... They're showing up a little bit later than usual. Yeah, you gotta be careful of those guys with those big swords. I don't know. I mean, they're more of meat cleavers, to be honest, but... Yeah, those guys are not... Something to mess around with. I mean, that could be said for anybody who just fights demons in general. But, you feel me? Like, yep. Catch this, catch this L, my guy. We're gonna just have him kind of come near me, and then we're gonna shoot that, yep. That's right, we're going, yep. Ooh, run the mans. Get over here, boy. <laughs> you finna catch this L, boy. You, oh, you got me, okay. Uh, I ain't stopping. I'm, they all go get this out real quick. If I try to do a combo on this man, I definitely don't want to get dismal. I at least want to get seat. Yup. Yup. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. Okay, not too bad. I could have done better, but. I guess it's what gets the job done for now. <laughs> mm. Yeah, they went through there. So I gotta go to that one, I'm pretty sure. Okay, that's what I saw last time. Cause I I don't know why, I thought I was going to a different area, so Bingo. that was in that area I just was in, fighting that other guy, but I'm at where I'm at now, so that's cool. <clears throat> Excuse me. Oh, let's go, it's up here. Oh, okay, yeah, so there's stuff down here. Come on, I could at least get that right. Yeah, no, nah, okay, there we go. Oh my gosh. That didn't make any sense why it took that long at all. Okay, yeah, so we're just gonna figure out what we gotta do around here now. But yeah, is there anything about this game you really wanna make sure you? Well, look everywhere. Let's be honest. Huh? You make sure you want to look everywhere. Because there's going to be stuff you want to get. Mm. Oh, snap. Oh, snap. Yo. Oh, nah. I already saw us. I ain't trying to have this happen to me. Yeah, yeah. Y'all tripping, bro. I'm out of here. No, no. Nah, I ain't no chum. You finna catch this friend. This is Oh, nah. Okay. Yo, bet. Bet. You finna really run the mans. You could be a demon, a sorcerer, what have you. You finna catch this L. Hmm. Okay, there she is. Yeah, we finna, we finna just throw them hands real quick. Gotta be careful, kind of. I feel like she'll do a lot of damage, if we're being honest here. You would think not. But... I'm not taking my chances, B. That's not that's not not that's not the way I do things, bro. Yup. Come on, yup. Put them hands. Ooh, that's good. That was a lot of XP. And red orbs, actually. Like her GTC is the one that gets me thinking that'll work. I'm like, you know who I am. 
It's your boy Nero. Okay, I'm just trying to books today, but you're also gonna catch this phase real quick, demon. Man. I really like the demon designs too, because they're really unique and very different than what you expect from a typical demon. It's always what I've liked about the Devil May Cry series. So I'm glad I'm playing it now. I haven't played it like in a long time. Like a really long time. I think since like PS2, which is had that when I was like at least eight, seven or eight. Yeah. If that, maybe a little bit earlier. Man, PS2 is a good game of content to be honest during time. Like the amount of the amount of games and effort they put in the games was so cool. Like I remember playing Metal Gear Solid 2, Spider-Man from the Foe, The Matrix Reloaded game, I believe so. That game was sick. Like, man, there's so many good games up there. You would you have no idea if you're a new gamer. Or a gamer of today's era. Man, they have some really fun games. I mean like you guys can't experience that now, because I have to think out better graphics and all that but like I'm just saying like nostalgia wise I mean don't get me wrong you know nostalgia is kind of baiting for all these movies making movies for you know based on nostalgia rather than just good storytelling from previous you know creations and so on and so forth but like the ones that you know use IPs from previous really good movies that were cla considered classics to make them better if not unique and better, to me, I respect that. But, yeah, that's another thing. But, man. Mm. Yo, she just, <laughs> what was that? Oh, no. Without strength, was that Nico? Anything. That had to be. Ain't no way it was not Nico. Cause why else would those windows bust through like that? It's crazy. Look at this blue orb too. Okay. Yeah. So what we're gonna do is call her up. Let's see what's going down. You're up, Nico. Yo, where did she come from? Yo, that's wild. No, I got you covered, asshole. Mm. <laughs> she just pulled the Trinity. All right, so you know how um, Tank and the Matrix, right? If you've ever seen the Matrix, the first one. Basically, what she does. Yo, sorry, what Tank does. Bring, just brings them in weapons randomly somehow. And it's just like, all right, cool. I got guns now. It's like, they just start shooting. It's like, where did they come from, though? But I thought that was pretty dope. And man, this song is a bop. I just, I just like the aesthetic that Nico has as a character. Not only that, just the way her shop looks, it's really cool. Cause like, you know, you have people um, like mechanics or whatever, who have like walls covered and just their stuff. It's like, at, th at that point, it's kind of unnecessary cause they don't even use all their tools. Then you have Nico that just has like a rectangular desk and an opening she could just leave that area from. And it's just like, a small section but she has everything she needs which to me is pretty dope it's kind of like a um i don't know how to explain it best guy kind of feel like it's what i have for my art desk and stuff i'm gonna be doing more drawing videos too actually so there goes that but yeah like for instance i just got my desk my supplies on one area and it doesn't cover the whole room so there goes that but man, this song is really good. And also, I really enjoy this game. My bad for hitting my mic. But I really enjoy this game overall so far. It's pretty dope. Hmm. Let's see what else we're gonna get. Yeah, we're gonna get that definitely. We're probably gonna need those too. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, let's see what else we're gonna get. We're probably gonna get some more um, arm abilities too now. Man, whoever made this song, 
Now, whoever made the soundtrack for Devil May Cry 5, they deserve a raise if they didn't get paid enough. Because to me, this this just this song alone itself, for this character, sick. And then you got Devil Tr Trigger with Nero. Nero, I believe that's how you say his name. I don't think it's. I don't think it's Nero. I think it's Nero. Nero. I don't know pronunciation that for a character how it would matter too much but I mean it does but like you know as long as you basically mean the same thing I don't think it really should matter too much okay we had a boss mission now I'm assuming oh yeah no this is definitely a boss mission I mean we didn't do too good against the last boss not not the chick with the scissors but the other guy oh yo he not playing Nero chill you here just dodge yourself like you're Neo? Man, you're not playing. No chit chat or monologue? <laughs> just getting right to the point, huh? <clears throat> Nero's like, squad up, B. Where's my mobs? <laughs> oh, bro. Alright, uh, yeah, we gotta be careful for those. I can't be taking those like last time. Yeah, no. We ain't falling for that this time, B. All right, let's keep going in. I hate when they always be doing that. Specifically for this one, now I feel like it's gonna be one of those kind of enemies. But it's gonna just keep doing that specifically. And you got a more, more or less. You know, follow it and then keep hitting it. Yeah. Be careful for these two. Yo. Man, that's good. So I hate when they do that in video games, specifically bosses. It's like you can't just stay in one area and catch this L real quick. They're like, nah, we're gonna make you wanna, we're gonna make you actually wait for it. I'm like, I don't mind that, but that kind of gets annoying after a while, to be honest. Yeah, you gonna throw this L real quick. Oh snap, we gotta, we gotta be careful, like, real careful. Right, that's not gonna work. You can't just keep shooting those guys. I don't know why, I think I felt like those would actually do any much damage, but they won't. So. We gotta grab on to them, I'm assuming, at this point. So, yeah, I was gonna try to keep hitting them. That's not gonna work, so. Let's try getting up there. Yup. There we go. There we go. We knocked her off a high horse. Yeah, we ain't we ain't having that. You finna catch this real LB. Or to my mother. <laughs> and you back at it again with this. I'm sick of that. Hey yo, catch this L real quick, cuz. <laughs> Gonna be a quick battle. Ooh. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's not that. There's a person in there. Oh man. Yeah, I definitely gotta beat this boss. Got him. So who's in there? Oh no. <laughs> that was kind of difficult. More of tedious than difficult. Mm. You know Thank what? God for censorship. <laughs> but. Uh, oh yeah, lady, I remember. I can't believe you do this to Kyrie. I'm gonna have to tell her, man. <laughs> Yo, chill, no snitch. Not my fault she got caught by a demon B. Hey, loosen up your jock strap. <laughs> yeah, okay. <laughs> Man, just her aesthetic specifically is so silly, but chill. would kill me right now. Yeah, he probably would. Or I think she I don't remember. I haven't played those games in a while. 
Ooh. Let's see what we get. Ooh, S? Hey, we didn't do too bad. We didn't do too bad. No, no, think about it. That's an S. All right, we're finna go to the main menu. Eh, I'll go ahead and raid him. I mean, I haven't really been playing with that person that much. But, I ain't tripping. <clears throat> yeah, I'm gonna try these secret, secret missions just to see, you know, what time I can get and which one I can get the highest to for that. Because that was fun. I remember putting that in the uh, second chapter for you guys. That was fun. But this is for those who either haven't seen it or because I didn't end up recording that by accident. Specifically for the secret mission. But this is basically what it was before I went into that building. And you'll be able to say, yeah, basically when I went over here, I see what I had to do. Yeah, we're gonna just test out how good I can get time and skill wise overall. Mm -hmm. Okay. I gotta see right now, let's see what we can do. Okay. Okay, we're at a C still. We can get a B. Yup, there we go. B. Come on, come on. I want to at least try to get an A or S. Ooh. No, no, chill. No, I'm just kidding. I'm about to grab this dude and just start throwing hands at this point. Yup. Get over here. Boy, I ain't having it no more. Okay, but, so what we're going to do is, our next video is going to be Days Gone, live streaming again. Thanks for watching, thanks for, you know, subscribing for whoever subscribed. Thanks for sharing the videos overall too, that was really sensational for that, I appreciate it. You have no idea. But, yeah, and also for art commissions, if you guys want to ever look me up. I'm going to put it in the description, or I'm going to comment it up there, and the same for email, in terms of what you want to have me do art-wise, if you guys want to pay for that, that'll be cool, just, you know, follow me on Instagram, see what I'm doing art-wise, and uh, I'll also be adding live stories, saying what I'm going to be doing for my next video for YouTube and so on and so forth for that, or just want to do in project art-wise, so, yeah, um, thanks for watching, that's really about it. So, yeah. Yeah, we're gonna try this again though. I'm gonna be recording for that though. And yeah. Have a great day. Comment, like, share, subscribe, you know. Because we're really trying to build this channel, do more stuff for you guys, you know, so on and so forth. But, yeah, there's gonna be more videos to come, so be ready for those. And we'll let you know. And I'll specifically let you know on Instagram. Basically, yeah. I'll let you know on Instagram. So, you guys follow me on Instagram and that sort of stuff. Or I'll just let you guys know by recording and uploading it. And for those who didn't know about it already, the videos that are uploaded, I'll just have it added to my Instagram story ahead of time, too. If I'm doing live streams and stuff, too. So, yeah. Just be ready for the type of content which we're going to make. Which is more than likely going to be gaming videos, some of my art videos, and whatever else we feel like doing too. I'm also going to be talking about more art stuff, more art oriented stuff, because I feel like I can definitely do it more of now because there's a lot of things I've been doing art wise now. I feel like I progress better as an artist and the overall. I feel like there's a lot that I can say for fellow artists or people who want to become artists too. But thanks for watching. Have a great day.